Hey guys, welcome to Does Logic. Uh, this is the 21st video of the playlist that I have created for you guys on Adobe Illustrator for iPad. If you haven't checked out the previous videos, I will put the links in the description. You can check them out. So without further ado, let's get started. So guys, in this video, I will try to explain the export options that are available in the application. So if you tap on this small export icon on the top bar on the right side, you will be given three options. Like first one is publish and export. Um, second one is quick export as PNG. And the third one is start live stream. So in publish and export, you have some uh, detailed formats to export your project. The second one is quick export as PNG. You can just simply export your uh, image to uh, as PNG into your photo gallery. And the third one is start live streams. You can do a live stream by tapping on this option and you have to follow some steps and you will be good to go to start a live stream. So let's start with the first option. This is the publish and export. Let's tap on that. And here we have some options. Like the first one is AI, which is the um, Adobe Illustrator uh, default project file. Uh, the second one is PDF. You can also export your image as PDF. The third option is SVG. And uh, the fourth option is PNG. And the fifth option is PSD. PSD is the Photoshop uh, project file format. So you can do and you can select any of these format. For example, uh, like tap on this PNG and tap on export. So you will be given same options as you do the quick export as PNG, as you can see, both are similar. So there is another scenario, like for example, this is a single image. What if I have uh, two artboards and I also have a shape on it like that. So what export options now this application will give me? So let's tap again on the export icon and go to the PNG and export. And now you can see there is the option to save two images at the same time. So this is the option that is very convenient and you probably know that in the desktop version when you tap Control alt e or export to screens, you have the similar um, uh, option and similar capability to export multiple artboards at the same time. So this will give us multiple artboard export. So this is also very handy. And uh, yeah, that's it for today. I hope you like this video. Please make sure you subscribe to the channel and I will see you in the next one.